It's very quiet when the sun's first coming up. And you just hear the sounds out there. Watching the horses in the semi-dark. You can just hear them. You can just hear the, the soft pounding on the track. In the winter, when you see them out there, there's a little bit of fog, and you can see them blowing the, the warm air out. It is a really nice time. The bar in the morning, especially when the sun's first coming up, it's very nice. Just the lighting that's going on. The grooms are essentially the nurses, the parents, the uncles, the aunts for these horses. And it's a kinship which is very, very close. And at 4.30 in the morning when they awaken, they go and they visit with the horses. And again, it's, it's a very moving experience to see this because the horses know that they're coming, the horses nuzzle up to them, they can communicate using a lot of non-verbal cues about how they feel. The grooms then communicate that information to the trainers or to the jockeys that come in at about 5, 5.30 and start exercising those horses. And the jockeys are the partners that allow these horses to once again run free, even if it's just for a minute and a half. When the horse comes back from the track, the groom takes the tack off, they give him a nice warm bath. When the horse is cooled out and relaxed, the groom gives them water and puts them back in their stall with another bucket of grain and a great big bag of hay and a nice fresh bucket of water. Bay Meadows has been uh, really an icon of racing. It's very sad to see such a significant part of history in, in this area pass on. <laughs>